There you go. Right, here we Hi, go. everybody. Uh, my name's Jake Solomon. I'm the creative director of XCOM 2, and I'm here with... Mm, mm. You, can say, <laughs> you can say your own you name. don't even know my own... Uh, Mark Nada, I'm a designer on XCOM oh, 2. thank God. Yeah. Actually, I wasn't even sure. <laughs> yeah. And this is Big Guy over here, a guy I've yeah. worked with for years now. Best friends. Yes. Um, so uh, we are going to start a whole new playthrough of XCOM 2 today. So today, a lot of the previews of XCOM 2 came out, um, and that was a build from about a month ago. So we're playing the very, very latest. A lot of changes, and we continue to make changes yep. day by day here. So maybe you'll see, maybe you won't. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if I'm like teasing with that or not, but yeah. well, this one's way better. Well, so. <laughs> the, the, the good news is yeah. that you've made some. I, I, let's talk about Mark first, right? Sure. Mark, uh, where are you from? I'm from Virginia. Oh, okay. That's enough about Mark. <laughs> okay, um, that's no Mark, interesting segment we did there. Mark is a designer on XCOM 2, and Mark, in addition to writing code on the strategy layer, yep. something that I used to do. Um, now Mark does that. And Mark is also in charge of the multiplayer uh, for XCOM 2, and also balancing... Balancing Legend, the hardest difficulty. So. Yes, so why don't we see how well he's done? Everybody right. should eat their own cooking, that's what I think. So today we're gonna eat Mark's cooking. All right. This is gross, sounds gross. I can do Crock-Pot, yeah. that's about it. <laughs> well, we're about to find out because Mark is going to start a whole new game of uh, Legendary, so. Yeah. So. Now, the thing about um, Legendary is that it's, or Legend, I don't legend. even know the name of the difficulty. Um, but yeah, so as we say here, it's a longer game with no margin for error. Only the strongest XCOM players will survive. And it is, it's, it's much harder than Commander difficulty, plus, it goes a lot longer. Would you it's not, I mean, not twice as long. It's, it's probably somewhere between like one and a half to twice. Yeah, um, yeah. It's, it's epic in scale. And a lot, it just makes you play a very different way. Yeah, you have to really utilize. Reload? Come yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, quick save, quick load. I'm just yeah. going to start it up here. Do you want to show subtitles? No. Nah. It's fine. Right. Uh, without Iron Man. You sure? Oh, yeah, no, no, no. no. <laughs> we want to. We want to continue this playthrough at some point. All right, so. Let's uh, go. Skip. We're skipping cutscenes, so. Yes. We won't spoil yes. too much. Oh, look at. Okay, so here's our crew. That's a good looking crew there. I like that. All right, so we've got uh, a crew of four rookies going into a mission that, and if you start a game without a tutorial, which you know, multiple types, you always start with this with this sort of operation, game crew. Right. So, so it's similar in theme to the tutorial mission, but you kind of get placed more right in the action than you would in the tutorial. So right, we're gonna go in and. Uh, Oh man, I like this guy here, Jam Band. I like yeah. this guy. The guy in the back cried, let's try and save him if we can. Oh uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll make a note of that. I'm um, sure I'll be completely under my control. Right. So, so yeah, Gatecrasher, our job here is to go in and we are going to sort of reveal our presence to the world. We've been operating the shadows, now we're gonna go in there, plant a little X4, bring down the statue, and um, announce our presence. So, right, so let's, uh, let's just get started. Yeah, you start in concealment. <clears throat> oh, interesting, interesting choice. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. Oh, these guys make I already revealed the advent so. forces we've dealt with. Right, They're that's good. So, well right there, the we've got. Makes them is that two groups of two enemies? It's not a four-man group, is it? Uh, not well, this early, right? Legend is very possible. Um, I'm just gonna. I want to get kind of a good view. Probably not gonna leave this roof right. quite yet. So just wanna try and see as much as I can. Yeah, I'll probably go down, whatever. Not that close. Um, yeah, so the key here is, when I've played, I've, I've you know, again, you, you want to trigger, the ambush is very, very powerful, especially in Legend difficulty. Like, yeah. you have to okay. use the ambush. You, you, the ambush at the start of the mission, you're, so you're using concealment to set up your soldiers, trigger an ambush um, on the enemy, and you, you have got to be able to pull that off in Legend because, no pressure, but you have yeah, to right. because if you, that, that basically wipes out a group of enemies from the board. Right, and just like in EU, um, it's just part of the difficulty is there's just more enemies, so if you can kind of get the jump on them, yeah. um, I'll overwatch in case. Roger, got my eyes right. on them. Right, okay, so here they are patrolling. I think there's two different There's only three, oh, yeah, this is definitely two. Oh dear. 
that's two different groups. So you've got a group of three, and then you've got a group of two, and Dr. Tigan probably talking about this. Their genetic one. structure yeah. now uh, includes human DNA. So they ideally, we don't want to fight both these at once. So ideally. yeah, <laughs> I mean, but let it ride. Uh, so I'm going to see if I can set up for another turn and let them kind of patrol and see if they die. Oh, look at that name. That is a great name. Oh, yeah. Ludmilla Lebedeva. That is strong. That's my maiden name. Will fight for resistance. Yeah. You know, I should be careful with my accent. Yeah, you it's know? probably hey. pretty offensive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Not probably. Yeah. Little middle of Lebanon. Definitely. And Shane Quinn. Oh my goodness, is he Irish? He's got to be Irish. So. Zoltan Cosmos. <laughs> Zoltan Cosmos? <laughs> you know what? These are like super villains yeah. we've got here. Alright, so I'm going to go a little close. I, I think I'll be cool with them. Oh, yeah, I see the objective there. Mark, I got to tell you, I, I feel position. like they all need to survive. With these names, like. We don't even have to customize these. We've got yeah. Zoltan, Cosmos, Ludmilla, and uh, oh, ta -ta, Shane. Shane Quinn <laughs> from the Emerald Isle. No, that's not offensive at all. <laughs> that one is <laughs> fine. Uh, let me, who else has a move? It's just Overwatch. Oh, wait, Overwatch. we have, do we have developers? Yeah, it looks like we have. Kelly oh, Gilmore, yeah. the executive producer of uh, Firaxis Games. There she is. All right, so nobody, they're still all standing together, so we might as well just kind of like blow this thing open, right? Oh, I can't get there. Plans change. Yep. So now the, the key about the ambush is, though, what you really want to do is take out one group. But if you ambush and there are two groups visible, that can be really tough, right? Because if you don't wipe them out, now you're fighting a large group of yeah, enemies. Yeah, because the enemies still do scamper like they did before, but... You're able to get the drop on them and kind of nullify that effect, but if you're unable to kill everyone, um, then you now. might as well have just kind of walked into them yep. on their turn. Yep. Um, now the thing about um, while Mark is setting up here, yeah. the um, you know the thing is this isn't like impossible. I think what we set out to do with now. Legend difficulty was make something that. You know, impossible was kind of borderline impossible. You you kind of had to break the game to play it, and I, and we didn't want to do that with Legend. We wanted to make a mode that was was clearly harder than Commander, and Commander is difficult enough. And I think a lot of the previews out today kind of talk about how how much more difficult that Storm Two is, and that's that's good. That's kind of what we were aiming for. And and Legend is a very very difficult mode, but it's it's meant to be it's meant to be beatable. You just don't really have any margin. Right. right, so yeah, your mistakes are much more costly. I think I can open them up with a grenade, which could... you're kind of hoping it's going to kill them, right? So, yeah, they have four health on Legend, so that makes a huge difference <laughs> because that means that your assault rifles are not guaranteed to yeah. kill. Them. So, assault rifles and grenades, neither are guaranteed kill, so yeah. that makes a very all big right. Difference. So, let's just it's like no one has like. Oh, the, the ambush kind of evolves while you're playing because you'll get guys with guaranteed damage and a lot of times I'll just, uh, you know, I won't put them in this kind of over, overwatch trap. Yep, yep. Um, or you'll have stealth rangers or sword rangers that you want to just run up and finish anybody off. But So I'm going to open up with a grenade. Do it, Shane. Do it for Ireland. It's all on you, Shane. <laughs> Three on all of them. Three <laughs> damage. That's not... How All we right. would choose for that yeah. to go. Shane, I, I gotta say I'm uh, disappointed. Zoltan! Aha! Zoltan, first five. Get that kill. Looks like we have one. So we got three. Not bad. We can, it's really now we just gotta deal with Look at that. One. Look at the promotions. We're hanging out left and right. Doesn't matter. Yeah. yeah. You can be pretty you free with promotions. Enjoy that while that lasts. Right. Um, so, now we gotta deal with the sectoid as kind of the next priority. Oh, this is not or, great. <laughs> or maybe. He's definitely going to miss, though. Uh, you can't take a shot at me, you, <laughs> you advent bastard. We're just doubling down on the <laughs> Yeah, we're just doubling down on the action. It's already too late. It's too late. The FCC is involved. Are going to get more angry? Come on. All right, so here's the sectoid. Looks like he's reanimating, so he is... Uh, 
Yeah, this is the downside to killing them, is that now we have a, uh, and you, you personally, nobody to blame but yourself, but you personally boosted the hit points of the zombies. Yeah, I, you know, actually, I had a bug that was like, they have the same health on easier difficulties. So I was like, you know what? All right. I feel that. When could that ever come back to yeah. mind me? I definitely won't be in front of a lot of people playing. And, um, this guy. I probably am gonna have to, Legend has a lot of, like you have to just do very risky things sometimes, because if there's too many enemies for you to deal with, you might as well go for like that, you know, super play. This one doesn't seem like that. I really yeah. need this guy dead. You, yeah, that's the thing, is you really need. I did not remember that that guy was Overwatch. Oh, oh, it's nothing but a scratch. I can take it to him. 82, might as well be 100. In the face. Oh. Good job there. Seven, when you only needed one. Yeah. Mark overkill not. <laughs> yeah. You know, I really, I really want the job done, so I, uh, so kill them and their family. Right, so. Um, this guy is not on Overwatch anymore, so I should, uh. Right. <laughs> now that we know that. Excellent strategy <laughs> to remove his Overwatch. So Throw I, all your bullets. I, so if I don't kill this sectoid, I'm gonna have to deal with the zombie, right. which he's kind of far away, so it might be okay. Um, but he's also kind of in a bad position, so I might want to like behind my troops here. Yeah, that's the thing is that, and, and this is what happens when you play Legend. Like the sector is actually taken a not great cover position. They're typically pretty good about being defensive, but man. Here, in this case, the sectoid is is kind of vulnerable because they're close. And so, if you could... Oh, this is a good spot. Yeah, it'd yeah. only be low cover. Well, I think I'm high cover, and he should be flanked. No, he's not flanked. He's not flanked. I'm, I don't no, know how this game works, He's Jake. not flanked. You have a good angle bonus, but he's not flanked. So... Yeah, so we can, like, see. Oh, yeah, open up the tabs. The tabs closed. Yeah, so that's our... He's in low cover. Right. But we're right next to him, so we get that boost. No I crit. mean, no crit. 65% might as well be 100. Yeah. There we go. Excuse me, one way. Okay. Mm. Come on, Kelly. And that <laughs> was when things turned. This is uh, the is danger of playing a legend online, though. Is Zoltan the only one we have left? Yes. Oh, wait, no. Ah, we've got Ludmilla. So we really, so yeah, you gotta take out the sectoid because first of all, they're the roving patrols on there, right? They could wander in. Yes, so I think, I'm, can you can you take out the sectoid? I think I gotta go here and just like. Hope for a crit? All right, let me, I think I'm definitely gonna move this guy closer and maybe try to get some guaranteed damage. So both of them are gonna be flanked if this messes up. But by the sectoid, which is a reasonable risk, from right. Legend, because the sectoid is not going to do enough damage. Right, so let me check. Well, unless they get a crit. Let me see if I have oh, grenade yeah. range here. Yeah, I should do that first. I'm so gonna <laughs> blow the cover I'm gonna off blow the cover for that one. Well, I think it, oh God, I oh. accidentally clicked. Oh, oh! Did I misclick? Yeah. No. Oh, perfect. No, that worked out fine. That now, was, of course, that was completely intentional. Now, uh, what we see here is that you should have done that before you moved your, uh, before you moved Kelly yeah. into the building, took a shot. Not that I'm pointing out mistakes you've made, but just yeah. for clarity's sake. Right, you know, it's easy to judge you. <laughs> right. That's what I 84, do. you Might as well be 100. Oh, God. <laughs> Come on, Bobby. Well. That's what we're talking about, taking those risks, right? That's right, <laughs> yeah. that's right. So, Sectoid's here, and He uh, might, this. he's going for his side ability, so it's not as bad, you know, if he... All right, that's pretty bad. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least he didn't outright kill him. And we've got... Uh, this, uh, he doesn't have a flanking shot either, so... All right, shoot at, a, shoot at the enemy and kill him. Shoot at the enemy, shoot at the enemy, shoot at the enemy. Wow. Mm. This guy's flank now. He's, oh god. Oh uh, yeah, good no Ah, you got lucky. The other thing is on Legend, they have a very good chance to crit. The enemy has a very good yeah. chance to critically hit you um, if they flank you. So getting flanked by them is, oh no. Oh, I forgot. Oh no, no. Not Quinn. 
No! I failed. Well, really, it was his three soldiers that let him down by missing. Well, at least this guy's panicked, so that's Panicked? Good. Two living soldiers. So that's Gotta get rid of the cycle. So this is still uh, it's still manageable. Definitely not great. But you're gonna you're gonna be in low cover there. That cycle it is on the other side yeah. of that wall. So we've got we we have got to get a we flanking. We should just flank them. And we should just get in right here. Yeah, right. right there. Take that spot right there. That corner spot. Where's my okay? This other one's not gonna have that shot. So right. If we could. So we move. need a we need a crit. We need a crit. So we're making we're taking. So he's got chances. what? Five health. Yeah. Five health. So. 85, might as well be 100. Yes! Oh, that's what you needed. Yeah. Kill One step closer to not embarrassing myself. That's on his path. That's a long walk. Yeah. All right. So, oh yeah, I forgot. Totally extra unexpected bonus there. Um, but because the soldiers panicked due to uh, right. psionics. He freed him he up. He was cleansed of that effect, but he doesn't have action, so. Um, well, this guy is flanked. Um, he has a flanking shot. I could go, Legend, it's like really, I, I want to take every bench I can get, so. And he'll wow. probably. Uh, right up on him. K5. <laughs> we haven't missed those before, right? Boom. Oh. oh, the slow-mo death. So nice. Target right. disabled. Get that promotion. So we, we kind of salvaged that. It looked pretty bad, but... Yeah, that went um, bad. That went pretty well, actually, for what it was. The fire is burning up above, so yeah, you see, like, the bits of stone will burn over time. You'll oh, because I have like, that grenade I did, yeah. Yeah. Fire so will spread and... Continue to wreck the building. Yeah, so generally get away. So we dealt with two two pods, I think. Right, and you kind of want to take a turn and, and, and sort of take stock. Yeah, I don't really want to rush into another one, so... I'm gonna kind of just move inch closer way. to the objective and just reload a bit. Reload the save, because <laughs> terribly. You're uh, doing pretty well. We got three soldiers. Yeah, really that engaging two pods at once, that was you know, about as well as you can expect with four rookies. So sectoids are, are very strong for your yes. for your starting soldiers. Yeah. Um, I'm ready. The admin guys are not that bad, but they, they do have out. that four health, which is kind of the, the magic. Oh, God. The oh, there we go. Okay, so creeping close. forward. Sure so I definitely did not want that to happen. Control. It is definitely not what we want. So this guy is just, I need to get behind high cover. Not that close. Right. These guys are fortunately. You also don't want to get near your other soldiers because yeah. that captain will drop a grenade on you. So. So I might just move back. That's probably the best. This should highlight how difficult Legend is, is that because we're talking about fairly subtle design stuff here that yeah. we kind of know what the AI is going to do. So definitely do not recommend anybody who plays Legend to start with. Yeah, unless um, you are some kind of masochist. Yeah, which unless you, you like XCOM. You hate so. your dad and you're trying to get back at him. Yeah. You know. to that's why, well, that's why I do it. That's, that's why Mark does it. Yeah. Oh my god. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> First time on stream, puts that on blast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's that about? Oh, he just marked his target, so most likely he'll take a shot at him. Definitely miss, yep. Right, so the mark ability, the, the captains, the, the, the officers have this mark ability where um, they like to mark targets and that makes them easier to hit for all other enemies. So, uh, yeah. Well, kind of lucky that Captain didn't hit, so we've got the third, and the third's Probably gonna shoot at him. Oh god, I was in his. I missed. It looked like he was shooting at his other being so bad. Gotta say, gotta say, it feels it feels like luck is on your side. Well, except for those point blank shots I missed. Right, but, that's true. But they miss them too, so that's really X going on in a nutshell. So now they're bunched up. The captain and yeah. the trooper are bunched up. They could be a good target for a grenade. Yeah, who has a grenade? This guy, you know. Zoltan does. Opa! He's pretty hurt, so I might as well just go up there. Don't take a good cover spot from other rookies who could potentially survive. Yeah. <laughs> um, Don't say that where Zoltan could hear you. Yeah. Zoltan, you are a valued member of the team, and we, we want you to... So, the captain has seven health, which is a lot at this point in the game, so... Grenade 
two grenades isn't even guaranteed to kill him. So, right. um, which it is guaranteed to kill that guy though. But the benefit of that strategy is that then he will now be out of cover yep. and open to critical shots. So I am going to move up here. Oh, it looks really bad, but he needs to get this grenade off. And I'm hopefully going to be able to do something about this guy. And if not, he's going to shoot at Zoltan probably. And Zoltan's going to die. He's expensive <laughs> at this point. Hard choices. Yeah. Honestly, he'd be wounded for a month anyway. Yeah. So Legend, oh yeah, Legend, the wound timers are extremely long. Would have been nice to kill the trooper there, but... Uh, and for the cover to blow up, but it must be tougher. Um, still good, still good. Um, I think we can get a flanking shot on... You sure can, right there. Let me see what this guy's options are. Where is he? Ludmilla. Ludmilla. So she is... I can get a flank on this guy. She's full health and promoted. She is worth her weight in gold in yep. a Legend playthrough. You really want to take a squatty into your next mission. You don't yeah. want to go with rookies into mission number two yeah. and mission number three. Yeah, we don't really let off the gas <laughs> with right. the difficulty, so um, I think I'm just gonna try to get a flanking spot, take out that one trooper. This will kind of dictate 66%. what I- 66%. This will kind of dictate what I might do. Can't miss. The other. Yeah, that's, that's guaranteed to hit. Oh, uh, yeah. okay. That's, that's why she got that promotion. Enemy that's destroyed. right, she earned it. A real go-getter. Um, so I think I want, the problem is if I go up and flank that captain, right? I will be flanked. Right. This guy is, mm, his mark will disappear when I kill the captain, so he, he's not guaranteed to shoot at him. Um, I think I can move back farther somewhere. No, there's not a lot of great cover. No. I mean, the, yeah, the problem is, but you're that close anyways, they're going to flank you anyway. Somebody's going to die. Yeah. Somebody is gonna so die. I might as well. Might as well. Because another grenade is not guaranteed. So I just I need to take this shot at him. Closing Lead on target position now. Yeah. From Mark here. Top tips. Double flank. Definitely want this captain to die. Yeah. Captain has better aim. Nice. All right. Oh loot. Drop nice. the loot. Yeah, loot. Kind of prioritizes the the higher ranked dudes or the harder enemies. It's not yeah. always true, but it kind of uh, oh. He's so got he's a pretty good shot. Oh, you want him to hit nice. the wounded one? That's good. We want Zoltan. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. On Legend, like rookies, if they're wounded, they you know they might as well be dead. Cause, oh no. <laughs> take take a shot. Oh dear. Shoot him. Kill him. Oh. Hey, that's not the worst uh, outcome. That is. Probably the best outcome, actually, besides him leading the floor. We've still got more enemies out there, don't we? Uh, I think this might be it. Okay, that's good. Um, unfortunately, Ludmilla doesn't have grenades anymore. I don't think I get close enough anyway. But I really just don't want to put her at risk. Um, I mean, he's probably going to shoot at Kelly here anyway. Maybe I'll just kind of move up here. Want that loot? You want that yeah, loot? Yeah, I want to be able to get to that loot. That's not a great shot. Oh, tough choices. Yeah, I don't have a lot of great shots here, so I might, I might just move up. Yeah. And Overwatch might actually be the choice here. Usually, um, Overwatch isn't the greatest choice while it's kind of going because you have the aim penalty. But right. they are—they're usually kind of flanked because they're on the open. Yep. Yep. 46. Do I think he's gonna move? He might not move. Oh, to he'll shoot move. This. Oh, actually, you're right. No, he'll move. He'll move for sure. He'll be fine. You heard it. Which designer is, is right? right? <laughs> That's the question. This is a Jake Solomon approved move here. Oh, what did I see? Oh, oh man, man, she is money. I'm, I'm glad and not glad that happened. Area is that secure. Happened. We're not picking up any inbound <laughs> Look at that. All right, now yeah, panic and move. So gotta go pick up some loot. So yeah, I got one turn left. Let's it see does. what we got. And that was an advent dude, so I think we'll get hopefully like a weapon upgrade. Yeah, nice. Okay, that's good. So give us extra ammo. And yeah, we've neutralized all targets, so. Um, I think we are. And she deserves the right to blow the statue, I think, because she is the hero. Yeah. Look at that. 
This is a uh, yeah standard XCOM. Her one clip soldier. is empty. Oh, I'm sorry. Her magazine is empty. Yeah. Her magazine, One's not empty. her clip. Her yeah. Magazine <laughs> is empty. Um, every one of those bullets had a soldier's name on it. Had been soldier's name on it. She was. Yeah. It's definitely a hero of that, that mission. Mission accomplished. Okay. Boom. That actually went surprisingly well for it how, did go well. For, for like the bad things that happened in it. That did, that went pretty well. Fair. Come on, game. I believe you hooked those ratings up, so. <laughs> Who did that? <laughs> um, yeah, so. That was good. Nine, nine, four so. rookies against nine enemies. Look at that, it says, Gilmore dealt the most damage and made the most attacks. Huh. Well, in our hearts. In our hearts, it's know. the villa, yeah. Well, they, they both survived without damage, so that should put us in good shape. That is huge, because that means, yeah, now you've got two squaddies going into the second mission, yeah. which is absolutely critical. Yeah, Legend, a lot of the timers are, are kind of roughly doubled, so you end up with these, especially if you get gravely wounded, these kind of you're out for a month plus. Yeah, of, uh, for a very long time. Um, but you have ways to deal with it, with facilities and stuff, but obviously right from the beginning of the game, you're not going to have that. Gravely wounded rookie might as well be dead. Yeah. Oh, I love these. I love the, the walk up afterwards, yeah. you know. Then you get their their picture. Right. Uh, let's uh let's promote. Operating some of our most so, uh, equipment. Here she is, she's a specialist, specialist, and that's good. That's actually good. Specialist is actually my favorite class. Is it? Yeah. They uh during my legend playthrough balance runs, they are very helpful. You can spec into healing, which is always good, and guaranteed damage, which is also very good. And hacking with so many enemies, being able to gain control of the enemy and stuff. But I mean, can't do it yet, but which so. path would you go with your first specialist? Combat hacker or combat medic? I think I am going to go combat hacker if I would. Uh -huh. Okay, a bold choice. Well, the thing is, like, it gives you an ability that you otherwise wouldn't have. Like, you can still heal, you just can't remote heal. That's true. Um, but remote heal is, like, extremely good. Um, and, like, the missions tend to take longer with the more enemies, so you're probably going to get hurt. So the, the medic route is pretty good. Grenadier. Grenadier. Always useful. Yeah, once we, especially once we get up to Corporal. That's the thing. Grenadiers are really, really strong, but later. Like later, yeah. I think later in the tree, that's when they get really, really powerful. Yeah, I definitely, you know, because, I mean, up, grenades themselves going to be upgrade, yeah. and then they get good abilities. Ooh, all right. Okay, so. so got corpses. Oh, here, you want some trivia? The only thing, the only writing, really, that I do that they would allow me to do, because I don't really do writing, you yeah. know, but um, the only writing I do is, is the, uh, the, true, the corpse, the corpse inscriptions. Yeah. They're a little heavy-handed, but... Uh, yeah, kind of send your complaints to right. Jake Solomon. That's right. <laughs> totally, totally read Don't send them. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we got, got the Expanded Magazine, Imagine. weapon upgrades, that's good. Labs. So here we are on the Avenger. Yep, and this is a non-tutorial playthrough. Oh, that's a cool background. So we can, oh, that is a cool background. That's like a, a, one of the destroyed like cities in city, one of the yeah. non-populated regions. It's beautiful. <laughs> So, once let's go to research, we're going to get a cutscene, which I'll skip. No, I think skip we've it. seen this one already. No, no, right? skip it. <laughs> I mean, it's completely new. Don't worry about it. I um, want to do research. So, these are your kind of starting ones. Right. Um, these research times are longer than uh, a normal playthrough not on Legend would do. Yeah. Um, yeah. Everything takes a lot longer on Legend, so. It's five days. It's not the opening ones aren't, like, doubled or anything because you don't really have the resources to. Right. Um, what do you think? I think since we got the weapon upgrade, we want to do modular weapons. Yeah, that's true. You can't um, use the weapon upgrades until you research the modular weapons tech, so we can do that one. Yeah. Hybrid materials is <laughs> just so good, though. Getting the, the uh, it gives you the, the more well, I don't want to say the, the EU name of it. It gives you the best. Nano scale. Nano scale. Nano scale. Completely. Completely. <laughs> yeah. Um, but having the one extra health is very beneficial as well. Right. So now we're going to meet. Dr. Shen, skip that. Um, probably gonna build stuff because You'd be yeah, it's funny. I on all my playthroughs, I do different things, right? Either I either I build some. I think you always have to build a med kit. You always yeah. have to build. Yeah, I always want kit. one med kit. I think. Flashbang is pretty strong. Flashbang is so good. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna think I'm gonna take one. That leaves me with 105 supplies left. 
probably keep those around in case I need to restock on dudes, which is very possible with uh, recruits and stuff. Restock on dudes. Um, but we can't really clear. We don't have an engineer yet. Um, Right. Actually, let's go look at the memorial. We've done what we can to honor our fallen soldiers, Commander. There they are. Oh, you served us. So you were with us for such a short such period of time. <laughs> we got to know each other over those zero days that you were uh, <laughs> that you were here on the adventure. <laughs> I love that. See guy. the world, they said. Oh yeah, you awesome. can write. You can write your own epitaph. Yeah. Is, uh, you know, great for you know, user-generated content, which right. we love. Right. Um, yeah, there's Central at the bar, per use. Yeah, <laughs> there's Salt <Old> Central. <laughs> it's one of my favorites, kind of in the background, not yeah. flying the ship like he should be. I love when it, sometimes it gets put to like tending the bar. It's, <laughs> it's like, the best. I think that's some dudes For most of our soldiers, the yeah. And you can imagine, well, Central probably has yeah. some really like off putting stories, <laughs> you know? Like, I wish that guy would leave. Right. <laughs> really down. He tries to tell you stuff, and you're like, good God, I don't want to hear yeah. this. So let's, uh, let's go out to the Geoscape. Get a cutscene there. While we prepare for new All right, so here we are starting research, brand new. The world is fresh. We have very little. Um, it's always nice to start a new game because, you know, it's, it's basically already spoiled, right? Yeah. We can't see much. We have a rumor here. I think I want that. So if I had stayed at Resistance HQ, I could scan for intel over time. But yep. usually these rumors are like a better value because they, they're not always available. Right. That's so. true. Avenger yeah, and it's a question of, I mean, Intel, so on, you know, you, you need Intel as this is a really fundamental resource in order to grow the resistance. Yeah. Intel's kind of a fundamental resource. Um, but the uh, supplies are always, always valuable, especially yeah. early. It's and it's going to be a bit before we can really utilize the, the Intel, so. Right. And we have, you know, some. So we finished it. We get some uh, flavor. Yeah, flavor. Um, but these are cool because they'll, as the game goes on, you'll there'll be more of them, and you'll have other stuff you want to do. Oh, another one appeared. Great. Oh, rookies. I'm gonna need that. That's critical. <laughs> do rookie? How much do rookies cost? I think they're 35. Yeah. Um, but it's really like that price increase isn't that steep, but. But a lot of the other stuff yeah. is way more expensive. Well, and you go through so many more rookies on Legend too. Yeah, so. they are. Uh, you know, they don't have a good time. These findings. Will likely Great. Attack, attack, so our ongoing uh, efforts. Set in there. Start new. So tinker. Got some more flavor. Right. So now we can put, in fact, after this, let's go take a look at our soldiers. But yeah, um, let's, uh, I want to do a weapon upgrade. Say so yeah, we can upgrade weapons now. So, like, if you look at this. 55 days yeah, to so research magnetic weapons. Not That's not going to happen. So, so maybe not that one. Yeah. Um, let's go for let's go for hybrid material. Yeah, we can handle that. Work begins immediately, um, Commander. So yeah, I'll contact you when here. I have a right now. We have the opportunity to put the upgrades on our soldiers. And it was expanded magazine. Um, I think that probably benefit the grenadier. So I think they have a, a little bit of a smaller. They what, do clip magazine. They do have a smaller <laughs> magazine uh, size. Um, because they the. The other weapons beside the assault rifle do slightly more damage, like they're four to six. Yep. So, uh, you know, they all have their kind of pros and cons. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. Yeah, and the other thing is that Grenadier's abilities cost a lot of ammo. Typically, right. the, especially the really powerful ones, they cost a lot of ammunition. So expanded magazine's always great. Always great. Kelly's just so sad. She is. See, that's her, that's just her attitude. So all <laughs> the rookies have random attitudes, and she yeah. is, uh, jeez, yeah. bringing me down here. Hey, uh, look, look at, at that, huh? She's happy. Why can't you be more yeah. like Ludmilla, Kelly? Yeah. What's what's the big deal? It's just an alien war. All right. Oh yeah, with the specialist now we get aid protocol, which kind of goes why I, I didn't want to take the smoke grenade either, because it's kind of like a single target smoke grenade. Yeah. So if you get a, a specialist early, then it's you, useful. Uh, All right. So who else do we have? Because oh. let's take a look at who's going to go with us into our next mission. We've got. Uh, so we got Margarita Vasquez. We got Pete Murray. Pete Murray? <laughs> wow, look at that. You know yeah. what? Let's take a look at Pete because these are always great because... Oh. Yeah, see, these are sort of like aspirational. This is how they view themselves, which I think I think is, that looks uh, a lot like Pete. It does, kind of. But now nah, we're not going to use Pete. Let's okay. let's take a look at Marguerite. Then we've got... Okay. Well, we got Sergey. Let's take a look at Sergey. We got some developers there. Like She's sad, too. 
What's the real, must be central at the bar. <laughs> it is, uh, with his weird stories of alien body parts and the things he's seen. At close range memes. Um, so, Sergey, maybe the other one. He, oh yeah, he's pretty bland. He, uh, you know, stoic. Let's punch him up a little bit. Let's go in, customization oh, yeah. is like one of my favorite things, so. Um, Sergey, let's go. Zaitsev, yeah. Let's give him. A, let's take a look at what we can give him. So I like to always put hats on it, dudes. So. Right. It's a weird statement, but I mean, just in life, <laughs> just general. <laughs> you might. Oh, you can't go wrong with the floppy bonnie. Look yeah. at the floppy bonnie. Yeah, you mind if I put this? Uh, oh, that's that's nice. That is nice. Sergey seems excited by it. So. <laughs> he does. Uh, uh, feel better about uh, about going <laughs> yeah. to your almost certain death now, yeah. Sergey? Yes, yes, you Let's do. Let's that off with the... Uh, Who's a happy soldier? I, I love bandanas. So yeah, bandanas are good, on. too. Seems like a... That's pretty proper. Seems like a biker to you, the floppy, floppy bonnie. I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Talk to me, Sergey. What do you mean? He's, he's part silly, part business. Oh, yeah. Hmm, hippie glasses. Hippie glasses look pretty good. Yeah, nah, he, he kind of looks like us. Sergey, big hippie. <laughs> you know what? Uh, he, yeah, he kind of, uh, he kind of strikes me. Yeah. All right. Well, I think uh, he looks pretty good. Um, Give him some color at least. Yeah, we can color him up. So what what color? Let's just go all the way to the bottom. <laughs> yeah, the <laughs> super bright colors. I, that's where I go first. You know, Sergey is not afraid. Give him like a a bright purple. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's, that's pretty boy good. right there. That is my boy Secondary right there. Secondary armor color. So they're a little more muted, unless you go to the bottom. Right. Then you go breaking artists' hearts. I like it. Yeah. Look how good this game looks, and it's just. Pff. Ooh. Ooh, double purple. Double purple. I like that. I like that. Let's get that purple weapon. I mean. Yeah. Let's let's do Sergey the while whole way up. While we're here. Oh man, he's like fluorescent. I love him. Yeah. I love him. He'll yeah. be our stealth. <laughs> yeah. You'll never see him coming. All right. So it's probably good for yep. customization stuff. But yeah, the customization is super awesome. I always spend way too much time doing it. Um, and the character bill helps with that. So. Yep. Um, All right. You ready to jump in? Yeah, I think we will probably clock a mission here pretty soon. We got one research done. Right. So we're looking at another rumor, investigating another rumor. As the resistance nope. continues to right. grow, new target acquired. Gorilla off. So these are the missions where we are as it is, taking on the advent. You know, we're kind of yeah. taking it to the advent. Um, objective driven. And here the objective is going to be recover an item yeah, from an uh, advent facility. That's not bad. That's, yeah. that's pretty good. Get an engineer. Which is. Crucial. Difficulty easy by legend standards. Right. Which is not very easy. That's good in there. Oh, you've got to fly back Asian to the region. Corridor. So you're always kind of moving around based on you know what pops up on the map. Yeah, I mean, towards the later part of the game, you've got a large section of the world to open up, and so you're kind of flying back and forth. All right. We definitely got the ditch Pete. We don't want Pete. We want uh, no. we want our boy Sergey. Yeah. Let's see this dude. Oh. Prince, all right, blends right in. Um, I think he, he's a flashbang. I think. Yeah. He seems like the kind of dude. He does seem like. <laughs> uh, I like. I still like to give the uh, the med kit to my specialists, even if I don't go right. to the because they're kind of a mid range unit that is kind of going to be in the middle. So. She's got double grenades there. Yeah. All right. Well, oh, that's probably good. And if we needed more stuff, we could just go straight to the item. A sad sack, you know, like Vasquez yeah. and Gilmore bringing me down. Let's yeah. just, let's just, just go. go. <laughs> we'll slowly turn around. Oh. I guess. So. And it's great because people should hear the uh, the VO yeah. the company's every attitude, which is pretty good. Yeah, they have some uh, VO calls. Fire mask. Operation pretty tame one. Fire mask. That's good. Okay, so we're going in. That was the other thing you coded. Jake's on special. That's true. The name That's generator. true. The old name generator. Oh, miss, and uh, right, and the uh, the neighborhood generator, Roach Hill. That's obviously. Oh, good. We get to go to slums. We haven't done slums before. Oh, this is exciting. Newly, yeah, newly revealed. Yeah. Um, 
Gallows sounds very uh, kind of like the neon and it just yeah, it is a it is a very cyberpunk vibe to it. It's awesome. Yeah, it's got the graffiti and environment team. Love the Zarn City is an awesome, awesome. Oh, oh it's it. like night and raining. It's great. That's perfect. Yeah. In every cyberpunk uh, story, it is always night and raining. <laughs> yeah. So, they, how else could the neon reflect from the streets <laughs> yeah. if it were so not night and raining? Are in place at the All right, so this one we're all starting out concealed. We don't always start out concealed, but generally, I think most draw you do. Yes, so. you do. So, because um, you are, you know, striking at them. All right. So we need to recover this container. It's going to detonate in eight turns. Yeah. So the, the timers aren't aren't adjusted for legends. So Don't need to be because it wouldn't be harder if they you know, right. made it longer. Um, so obviously Sergey is going to be our, our point man. That's right. Um, let's, let's go ahead and do a standard full cover move though. No need to go too crazy. Doesn't see anybody. Will I be flanked if I go up there? Definitely not. Sure. This is entertaining TV people. Yeah. Yeah. So let's just just move up a little bit. Uh, Ludmilla, I don't need to go up that far. No. That's the other rookie. Get up there. Right. Ludmilla, we see that. No need to ask twice. Oh, man. I would have put that behind that cover because... I've got enemy movement oh. here. Oh, yeah. Yep. Because of that. They won't see her. They probably will. Right, so now they have, and now we can see what where their detection radii is. So if they don't move... They've, they I'm don't. flanked, though, so it looks like I'm going to... Right, so if they move, yeah, if they move close enough, if those detection radii touch her and, and she's flanked like that, then she's going to get revealed. So there's a chance they won't see her, but... Um, yeah, so, yeah, I should have moved there because I had knowledge of kind of what's over here from this dude, but, you know, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> what's the worst that can happen? I'm sure it'll be fine. It's just a rookie. So at least I didn't move Lemuel up there. So in this case, yeah, they gotta go to Overwatch because there's a good chance you're gonna get revealed. Get revealed. Grenadier, Grenadier will be good because the chance to do enough damage, a better chance. Well, if I hit, it will kill. Yep, um, that's right. You're guaranteed with with any non-specialist class, you're guaranteed that they should be able to start killing the troopers now. So that's good. Yeah. Roger. If they hit. Let's see if they. Oh, they went, oh, the they went the other way. That's very, very lucky. I knew lucky. that would happen, so that's why I moved there. Perfect planning. Right. They're now. probably still gonna. Say. Nah, they're coming back. <laughs> yeah. Well, what are you doing? All right. I think you know, that's the thing is that it's a very big change from Enemy Unknown. On XCOM 2, the AI follows its own dynamically generated patrol routes, yeah. and so you know, there's no. Yeah, you could be fighting, and then someone just kind of wanders in. Yep. There's no pre-placement of enemies at all. They are. They are simply dynamically yeah. placed at the start of the map. They don't know the procedural map any better than you do, so they just start walking around and patrolling. So yeah, so it, uh, we really have to be able to adapt a lot better. I think you can't just kind of entrench yourself anywhere. Right. Closing on target. That with like the threat of reinforcements as well. Right. Will make you kind of shake up where you like to. You're riverboat gambler. You're going into low cover. It's you know it'll be fine. That's a uh, Moving to designated sort of coordinates. passive aggressive ding on your skills. I oh, I didn't catch that at all. <laughs> <laughs> so, still got the threat of being revealed. I probably won't. You know what? Oh my god, are you serious? Do it! I, I want to see what happens. Well, the thing is, yes? there's, so many, there's so many enemies Go on. that I need to make progress towards the objective. That's true, that's true. Um, in Legend, you you simply cannot you cannot take any time to set up ambush. You kind of have to set up the ambushes as you go because you. It's like if you have a decent ambush like chance, like you probably should take it. Yeah. Um, okay. She. So then, what are we doing? Here? She had only moved once. So. Oh, here Ooh. we go. This will be good if they. Uh, that's that's good. That's good. Wait. That's oh yeah. Good. Okay. All right. He, so, he looked like he knew what we were about, but oh, they're right next to a car too. Ah, this is ideal. Uh, this guy's got a flashbang, so. But, so, like, if I move, I you can see the little markers. I'll, I'll right. be revealed, so. She's completely locked in place. So, that means the ambush is probably going to happen now. <laughs> um, Let's do it. So, this guy seems like a clear Overwatch candidate. Do you see something purple? No, yeah. it's probably just a piece of trash. Everything's there. purple in this cyberpunk world. <laughs> <laughs> um... I could open up with a grenade, it's not a terrible idea, but there's only two of them, I don't really want to... So if you could get up top, right? I mean, can Ludmilla get... 70... 
floor is pretty good. Can Can we, we really, really get to get the second there? floor because that, of course, is... Oh, yeah, we got a drain pipe right there. I'm on the move. That's huge. Of course, I guess she's moving forward, so there's the risk that she could reveal more enemies. Yeah, that's... Oh. See, so now she'll be she'll great. A pro oh, 95? Yeah, it's beautiful. Guaranteed. No, Once no again, way that'll miss. Ludmilla saves the day. Now, I could... I might actually not do the Overwatch trap with the Grenadier, so I can... Because grenades are guaranteed damage, so I might uh, just save it in case I need to clean one of them up. Right. Because I really don't want to... If you have the chance, you don't want to be fighting guys for more than a turn, especially with just like two, two Avant Troopers here. Right. Um, a lot yeah. of times you really don't have a choice in Legend. Yeah, a lot of times you don't even want to put everybody on over like sometimes yeah. you, you need to like just try and hope that you can kill them with a couple of people because yeah. you want to keep advancing towards that objective look they're talking look at that he's like and anyway did Take you see care. the glow ball game yeah. last night oh my god <laughs> fred glow ball's cannon <laughs> Oof. oh yeah. she's sad but she takes care of business yeah. Margarita. she pulls it pulls it together every now and then all right, so now we're going to be revealed. Um, Muy bueno, Margarita. All right. All right, this guy, oh, I haven't moved yet, that's why. Okay. I saved my Grenadier for no reason. Um, I really don't want to, I'm not going to do what I did before and move up even more. So I'm going to kind of go up here. Yeah. No need to ask twice. Move it to a safe location. And yeah, staying high is so crucial. Like getting that aim advantage is so so crucial. Yeah, it looks like there isn't anyone else on this roof, so this is same. Moving to position. Unless there's these over yeah, here. I, I, sh I have another move, so. Right. So I can see the objective building. Where are we headed? Is that the objective building? Yeah. Okay, right in there. All right. So there's a, a recover an item from there. Oh man, there have got to be more enemies around here. <laughs> yeah, probably not. We're Just probably fine. Dash. Yeah, I mean, I can see over here, so I might as well just like go up here. Copy that. Because it's gonna take me a turn or two to deal with whatever enemies I come at, across, so I really want to get as close as possible. Luckily, I have a um, specialist who can do stuff remotely with some objectives. So that's true. That is that's another thing that's huge about Legend, because because it is hard to get the objective. It's nice to have push. the specialist who can hack remotely, so she can complete a lot of these objectives from a long yeah. ways away. Um, I don't want to take that risk. Kind of Closing on target here. position now. Um, yeah, a lot of, you, you find these kind of quirks with your units that help with certain objectives, like the, the Phantom Tree of the Ranger is great for, yeah. you know, scouting and, you know, some objectives he can get right near before you kind of go loud, or you can go loud, then he can still kind of go towards the objective. Um, oh, I'm just gonna watch as well. Scanning. Oh, nobody around, cool. So we're gonna start moving up with the rookies. There might be someone over there, but nah. Hey, but you know, probably not. I didn't see anybody. Wow, this is crazy. They must be like This is not gonna be good. Playing, when you see they're them, playing dice on the box. <laughs> this is not gonna be good. They're throwing bones on the actual container. <laughs> That'll make it much easier. There is a, there is just a right. giant clown car of enemies coming soon. So. Well, where are the entrances? So it looks like I actually have to kind of go this way. Oof. Okay. Um, this is actually going to be because you have the specialist. You're probably okay. My gut reaction after playing hundreds of these missions is that like. Position confirmed. Yeah, you got. It's going to be. It's going to be close. Yeah, it's going to yeah. be real close with. All right. So I'm gonna. Yeah, no need Basically, three turns left and outside the building, and almost assuredly, there's bad guys in the building. So this is going to be actually pretty it's tight. Be tough, yeah. Double time. Um, well, you know, we'll get through it. Yeah, no problem. We got two squaddies. Uh, I've, that's not worth the risk. If I reveal somebody there, it'll be awesome. We're, we're pretty close now. I mean, about three turns ticking. left. That the design is for God's sake, away. right? <laughs> yeah, we know exactly what's going to happen now. There's two things we're good at. It's playing the game and taking credit. <laughs> well, some of us are good at that. <laughs> right. Boom! I'm the best at <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I actually, yeah. Uh, I, I patterned it. Actually, kind of bad. <laughs> credit, so. No big deal. Oh, hello. All right, here we go. I should have moved more dudes before I did that. Probably. But, you know. 
live and learn, or, <laughs> yeah. or the opposite. I've never played this game before. You know? Sergei Zatiev. Time to earn that purple jumpsuit, my friend. Uh, well, do I have a flank of that window? That might be actually fantastic. That, mm, wait, go in there and see, go in there and see. So, uh, yeah, you do. Oh, it's beautiful. Let's go in there. Margarita. Margarita. All right, see the objective. Right, back here, man. It's always terrifying. Oh, go now. <laughs> Instead, we've got the objective. We're running out of time, both figuratively and, wait, that's not right. We're running out of time in the game world, yeah, on all levels. Boom! Margarita. Oh, dear. Well, that's, that's still good, it's still good. So, I wish this wasn't the middle. I don't know why I moved up there. Um, so I'm probably just gonna get her out of here. Yeah, you can't afford. I mean, she's probably gonna get hurt this mission. I might try to you do something with a flashbang. Bang. With the flashbangs is... will not hurt allies. Yeah. Because, and that was something that we debated, but you know, it, it's Closing something that it's pretty now. punishing. It is very punishing. And there's already enough uh, punishment. Already enough punishment. <laughs> can I get a good throw here? I think oh, I can. Man, if you could get that. I think I can get the sectoid. It's beautiful because if you disorient the sectoid, they're not going to be able to do their uh, sound abilities, which is crucial. Obviously, their mental abilities. So if they get disoriented by flashbang, look right at it. Okay. Yeah. That's pretty big. So this guy is the more dangerous one too, and he's he's his, he gets an aim penalty, which is nice. Right. Um, They've got that one trooper. Try to take this other flanking. Yeah, thing. take another one. You're not gonna miss twice. Yeah, that's that's actually impossible. That is <laughs> actually impossible. 84. But she's got the poor damage though. Oh, guaranteed to kill. If you, there we go. Oh, super so overkill. Feels so good. Got him. Oh, is it creepier when I whisper? Yes. Yeah. Very <laughs> much so. Yeah. Good. <laughs> All right, so this is good. Situation's not yeah. bad. You got so a disoriented I, I kinda, sectoid. Yeah, I moved a little too close, but we were able to uh, recover. Right, and so the sectoid's options are limited when they're disoriented. Yeah. So he's gonna take the shot. He's disoriented, so he missed, which is great. Um, they can't move far either, yeah. so they're very, very ripe for flanking moves here. So I think the disorientation is gonna run out soon, so I kind of have to make moves. Um, and the objective, I have. You know, I have this turn and the next turn to get it. I could yeah. like do it. No, I can't get there quite there yet. She um, could do it through the window. Couldn't Lou Villa do it through the window? Well, she can't get to the window. Okay. Yeah. Um, she could do it through that window, but sure, you're gonna wake somebody up behind Overwatch, that building. So I'm telling you, there is another group of yeah, enemies there's wandering there's around. More enemies here. Well, I have. Uh, do I have a shot at that second one? No. You can't go through the window because those are laser bars, which is a patented advent technology. Um, so we're just going to... Oh, that's not bad. I think we're just going to... That's a great down. idea. Remove the cover. It's just kind of shoot through the window. Yeah. Down. Hopefully... Well, this will remove his Overwatch, too. Um, nice. Yeah. I balance this. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, he should be flanked by somebody. Flanked. Overwatch removed. Damage. Um, It'd be great if I could actually get the kill over here. I could use those other ones. 72%. And I have to get full damage, but could crit since he's flanked. Great chance to crit. Five. Oh, great. It's beautiful. Taking care of. Looks at the camera. <laughs> oh, she kind of, <laughs> kind of fucking mad dog the camera there. Uh, this guy, I really want him dead. Oh, I thought you were talking about Sergey. I really want Sergey dead. <laughs> Looks too good, too beautiful for this world. Yeah, there is like the very real risk I could. I think it's actually more dangerous over here. Yes. So I want to. I'm, I'm going to go flanked with this dude. We can almost guarantee their enemies walking around behind the building. So. All right. Oh, thank God. <laughs> All right, 85. Yep. Oh man, he's just looking you in your eyes. He's like, what are you? No longer a threat. <laughs> <laughs> I get killed by this guy. That's <laughs> yeah. the last thing you see. This God, that's a dishonorable death. All right. All right. So, how are we losing okay. to them? <laughs> yeah. Such tacky action sense. Uh, oh, nice. So, the recover items have a, a detonator on them. So this is yeah, and that's pretty big because now because you can remote 
remote hack that chest to recover the item. That is actually a really big deal because otherwise you are going to have a really hard time getting there. And then I don't have to risk you know, revealing more and right. stuff like that. Um, Her hack score is pretty good. So what do we? What are our options here? So. This would be amazing, but a super low chance. Luckily, the, the objective ones don't really have a negative effect. A lot of the other ones will right. have yeah. some terrible thing that'll happen if you fail. Enemy protocol is great, because you can boost your hack score by a huge amount. But and then it's like the rest of the game yep. kind of changes your whole strategy. But I think we probably want to try for this one. Unless we, well, uh, who cares? <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, I was going to say, yeah. Yeah, what, what the heck, go uh, for if it. If this man. hits, Ludmilla will be legend. Ludmilla! Oh! Damn! <laughs> Damn it. Still love Ludmilla. It's all right. We're good to go. So the gremlin grabs the item to you right there. So we, oh, so they were, our suspicion was correct. They were somewhere lurking back there. I, pro I might have revealed them if I, uh, if I went up there. Uh, so we kind of know they're in this general direction. So let's let's just kind of move over there. All right, let's do it. Now we're gonna go to speed run mode. Yeah. Because I think you're playing so well, we don't even have to worry. Moving to designated position. Hey, oh, there they are. Oh, there they are. Right there, like actually right there. Just chilling out, out back. Um. Wow. Well. Got a grenade. Not. So I have. You could rip the cover off that. Stuff, I haven't got any loot, so one of these guys probably has loot. But uh, you know what? You know, living unwounded soldiers is more valuable. Yeah. Uh, in most cases. You can at least use the grenade to rip the cover off the sector. Right? Yeah. I think I want to use my grenadier's grenade for the. Hey, you could use the grenade to rip the cover off the sector. <laughs> I could do that, Jake. I guess I'll do that. I don't know if I brought that up yet, but... Little known mechanic here is you can use the cover, or you can use the grenade. Yeah, let's just destroy like all this guy's cover. Do it. Throwing grenade! Here we go. Boom. Oh, yeah, I have to check that one too. I wish we could roll some fours, that'd be nice, but... Can't have everything. Can't have everything. You oh, got a lot. Flanked. I don't really want to move Ludmilla up. Man, look how wrecked this building is, this admin facility. It's going to take I shouldn't have been storing that item there. Place. Um, okay, so Ludmilla's in a good spot. I think I'm going to take this shot and try to get the closer sectoid. Do it. She's, you know, slightly leveled up, so guaranteed to hit. Oh, 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 oh I dropped the loot, yes. too. Yes, and oh, dropped the loot. Perfect. Yeah, you can use explosives on enemies. You just can't kill them with the explosive, otherwise they won't drop their loot. Yeah. Oh, she's flanked. This is not great. I, I might want to just grenade the flank dude. Grenade who's flanking you? Yeah. I could That's get the kill. That's what my grandma always said. Yeah. Grenade who flanks you. Yeah, like grandma. I had a very, <laughs> very weird grandma. Yeah. It's like grandma. Grenade. Didn't make any sense when she said Trying to enjoy Thanksgiving dinner here. <laughs> Another three. Another three. Um, I think I can get a shot. Maybe. But I think the people, people of the world really appreciate the work XCOM is doing by blowing up their homes <laughs> yeah. with abandon. You live in the slum? Don't worry, Boom. we're here to help. <laughs> yeah. uh, Alright, I think I just gotta move him up. I, you know I should have? I should have aid protocol for, before I took that shot. You probably should have. You know, but what do you Moving to designated positions. Oh, somebody's, oh, this guy's flanked. Perfect. If I get this kill, it'd be great. Purple we... Rage. Oh, nice. Boom. Is that two kills for Thursday? <laughs> That's Michael Jackson, not Prince, but. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was my best Prince impression. <laughs> yeah, that, you know what, I'm gonna that, work on that. That was my Prince. <laughs> oh. Yeah, this guy is intimidated by what we're doing, so he kind of backs off. Um, I really hope he's the last guy or else I, I'm, I'm being pretty liberal with my grenades, so yeah, she's out. He's on Overwatch. This is where like having guaranteed damage would be really nice. Yes. Um, a you lot can, of later abilities you can guarantee damage, but it's usually not a lot. But it just helps kind of ping off Overwatch and stuff. I think I gotta take this shot. 54 is, you know, more than half. It's more than half. So I don't know if you guys oh. See, that's good. Yeah. 
Is that it? Please. Yes, that's it. And we'll get that loot automatically. The big man, the barfly, appears and lets us know it's time. Look at Wallace! Hey! Watching Garth design this? That's great. That was pretty good. Yeah. Pretty, pretty good. So, uh, Operation Fire Mask, a success. A resounding success. Right. A new record, new record. Look, everybody's happy, that's what I like. Yeah, yeah. On the drops of even sad Gilmore uh, has got a smile on when you, when you, when you pull she's off a flawless. She's got a rough exterior, but... She does, but honestly, goal. yeah, she's, she's executing Teddy Bear with grenades. Okay. So, um, that was pretty good. Two missions. I, I feel good. Yeah. The uh, beginning of the legend is tough because you don't have a lot of options with your soldiers yet, but yep. we, we got through it, so. It's clearly not hard enough. So yeah. we will continue. I'll crank, I'll crank that up, yeah. We will continue to balance. Um, as you guys, um, if you want to know more about uh, XCOM 2, all the previews, um, yeah. or a bunch of them, went live today, so go out and read them and... and Always tune into our stream and go to XCOM.com and, and, and uh, wash your hands and uh, wear your seatbelts. And we love you and good night. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Oh, yeah, Mark's here. Yeah, I'm Mark. <laughs> <laughs>